I see anything move? Yeah, I see something moving. Very good. Let's. Whoa! Don't break my thing. Okay. Let's go find out a good location to build our contest build. I'm trying to think. I, I got a good spot, I think. Welcome in. I am going to work on the contest build for Enshrouded. Those who like to watch and give ideas. What I'm thinking... So this has to be Halloween t style, haunted mansion, uh, graveyard, whatever. So I'm thinking this jobby right down here that no one ever does anything with. It's in. It's actually in the shroud. So that there's your first location where you go to fight the first boss. I think I want to try down here. And see what I can do with this tower. Because there's not a lot of building area. You can't go down very far. It, it hits shroud right here. So there isn't a lot we can do with it. But I think we can do enough. And I think it could be really interesting. So first things first. I need to place a temporary altar. Because I don't actually want the altar up here. So let's... I think I want the altar inside for a certain... Man, trying to remember controls when you haven't played in a little bit. <laughs> and you played other games, you're trying to remember those controls. Alright, so let's stick it there for right now. So we have a spot, and then we're going to be able to... Uh, get our menu open, and be able to do stuff. i to make sure I got the right... I do. Okay. Cool. So, let's get out of here. No. No, no, dang it. There we go. So we need to come hop down here to go inside. Let's see what our building limits are. I mean, it, w level one altar might work. We, we can only go up to level two, and level one altar might just work to get what we need, because I, I have to build with inside this if I'm going to keep... And I want to keep this, so that's going to be a tough part. So the idea is to put the altar in this here somehow so I'm going to be doing a lot of digging uh, and I got to check where my walls are so that's all stone there so I could I could dig all of that out in case it's bigger all right so we need this guy let's go bigger um should I take this out should I leave a little bit of it just just so it has uh maybe just leave a little bit of it but dig as much as we can because we need space we're gonna need a lot of it all right so now let's go back to this size I think this will help us really open this up and give us more room to build whatever we're building in here. And I don't even know what it's going to be yet. Alright, so we're at stone there. So there's a staircase out there. i gotta got to be cognizant of that, that I don't break into that too much. It's working so far. It's giving us the space we need. Now, my question here... Okay, so if I come in... You're going to want some kind of a... a stair... So what if we came down one here? Then down two here. Gives us even more space. At some point we're gonna hit shrouds. So we're not gonna be able to do too much excavating. But that works. So we got a we got a pathway. We got this. Yeah, 
I don't know how much more we can get down there, but we can try a little bit. Let's see how much further I can get. My, if I remember correct, because I've, I've done this before, if I remember correctly, I can only go down like one more tile below where I'm standing, and it's shroud. So there's not much we can do with it. Dang it. Already, we got a pretty reasonable sized room. Alright, so if there's a pillar there, I'm guessing that's going to be the edge where the stairs are. Which means... I'm guessing we can't go much further. Hmm, well... Maybe I'm guessing wrong. You know what I need? I need light. What do we got here? I've only got one with me. Well, <laughs> one is going to be enough then. There we go. Alright. Uh, 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 uh. I just saw it. Shroud is right here. I'm gonna bet. Hmm. Well, see how much further we can push. I don't mind there being shroud inside the base. That's cool. I, so I'm happy for that. Okay, we're definitely enshrouded there. Alright. We got foundations. God, it can't be letting us go too much further. Okay. We are to the one. I can't go any further. So that is to the to the singular block. Okay, I need to see something here. So if we go. Okay, so that's basically this. And essentially, I already exceeded... Am I into... question is, am I into this right here? Or am I further in than it feels like? I don't think so. I think I'm into this right here. I don't think I even want to repair that, even though it would give me more space, I think repairing it would kind of lose its appeal. I'd like to keep the out exterior identical, or as close to identical as possible. And, it, and maybe I'll move the flame altar right up here on top, maybe, as a feature. Just something that lets it stand out. Okay, so this outer wall... I have quite a bit I can come out into the outer wall. Maybe even do a uh, some kind of a window feature. Let's see, how do we want to do this?
Okay. Right, so it's two out. Can maybe go a little bit further. Come on, let me see it. Since I can't go that far, go any further that way anyway, unless I just want to have individual pieces. That would let me know where I'm at. Do you like an arrow slit? So that I know where, where in Waldo I am. way up there. I'm clear up here. Okay. Alright. Wonder how much further. Shrouded there. Problem is, if I dig any further, I can't build anything. So I wouldn't be able to place anything to replace what I built. Wouldn't be able to have a solid floor. I kind of think I want a floor. So being up there, this is mostly the staircase, so I can gut a lot of that as well. I can always leave that column. Okay, over here, so I'm out to right there, I think I can go another full, another full depth, damn it. I just all already figured out what I want for this space. <clears throat> so right here, where I'm digging this out of the stone, I think is going to be a jail cell for the uh, denizens that we're um, experimenting on. I think this is going to be a uh, necromancy tower. Yeah. I think this will be a necromancy tower, and this will be the... So this will be the, the lab, I think. And over here we'll have the jail cells that we're going to put the... Well, unfortunately, we, we can't actually put NPCs in here, or even skeletons. Hopefully they'll give us skeletons at some point to place, like placeable skeletons. And then maybe there'll be a big tomb right here. And then machinery over here to do our work, to do our, our nasty work on whatever we're, uh, whatever these experiments we're doing on these guys. I don't think I can get much further out unless I go inward at this point. Let's find out. Nope. I'm literally one, one block away. But maybe... Here, let's go from this side.
I see the mycelium growing. That's perfect, because I'm going to pop some in there anyway. Get a little bit of the growth going on, the glowing growth. All right, let's see if, so that, okay, so this brocked, so I think I can go one half block more. That did work. Okay. Oh, that could be the door entrance right here. Could be one cell instead of two cells, maybe? I don't know if anybody's like me. I, uh, I find a site. Well, hello, Sub. Thank you. I find a site, and I kind of let it talk to me. I kind of... I have this idea for what I want, and then I let the site kind of determine how it's going to go. I'm probably crazy in that, but I think it works out well. Uh-oh. Are we peeking through? I think it's just light. Do I have... Did I pick up any uh, stone while I was doing this? No. Yeah, maybe I'll fix that later. I think that might be deep enough. I think that's probably good. And then we can put our cage bars and stuff. Now, should we pave it... Castle stone. Let's go to... Right? Oh, should we do roughly cut? Or, uh... Wait, 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 weathered. Do we have weathered? I don't think I have any weathered on me. I do! Okay, here, let's try this. Uh, da, 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 let's change to this. Oh, that's gonna be tough to get rid of those. I don't know if it's gonna let me. Yeah, it will, that way. Perfect. Caused my ceiling to grow. Awesome. Works out just like I wanted. Now, can we get this just how I want this? Hmm. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we can. <laughs> Look at that. Alright. Yeah. Where's all the bones? Why isn't it spawning bones? It's a little unusual. It's not spawning bones. Okay, so we gotta be careful with that. We want, like... That. There we go. So, that gets us a nice little, uh... Floor that isn't spawning bones for some reason. I also didn't go far enough with this over here, apparently. There we go. Yeah, uh, it spawned a little bit. Not really, but... Good enough for now. We need to get into this wall some. So, I wonder how much... So, if this is the stairs, I should even be able to break through some of that, too, before I get to the stairs coming down. To give me more interior volume. Okay, so that was the outer wall... At some point, we'll hit a tread. Okay, so we are seeing some exterior pieces. I see it right there. But I kind of like the messy look. Alright, where, where are we going to hit stairs? Uh, not yet. We are hitting broken wall, though. Quite a bit. Uh, there's broken wall again. Okay, so I need to stop with that. I'm gonna have to... pull this back some. A little too much there. Okay. Let's get one in this spot so it doesn't... Come on. Nope. 
Yeah, down. Which one is it? This one? It's this one. It was that one, okay. Let's got that. Uh, let's see how much further we can go. And now we're hitting broken again. Oh, now we hit it badly. This is the damaged uh, underside. Ooh, I wonder if we can make a feature out of that. Let's see if we can. See if I make some kind of like bars like feature. Something hidden enough that plain view isn't going to see it, but. Oh, okay. Alright, let's go outside and take a look where we ended up so I know where I, what I can pull back. If you haven't seen it, I'm the guy that built an entire base inside of a inside of uh, Braylon's bridge. It's the whole thing, so I just need to chuck the whole... Rewind the whole thing. Okay, so that is too far to go. Which means that's going to be too far to go. Which means I can go to here... And technically, I should be able to go to there. And if I do this... Should be able to do this, because it's following it one step down. And there we are. So now we're one block. There's one... That's basically a stair tread at this point. And this, I kind of want to leave it and see if I can cinch a, uh, a, a prison fence in there. I think it'll look really nice. So yeah, that gives us a good chunk of this thing we can gut out and use. This space is turning out to be really nice. We got our little prison cell over here for our whatever guys are the, the people we're doing experimentation on. Gonna have equipment over here. I think what I'll do just for the contest is I'll go ahead and put the alchemist over here. And the Oh no 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 no. Ah, I know what I'm gonna do. It's the the um why can I never remember his name? The Hollow Halls dude. I'll transfer him over here just temporarily. For the uh, contest. This will be his uh, experimental lair for necromancy. Necromancy? Okay. That's an interesting hole right there. Do I have any. None? I'm actually really surprised I haven't gotten it. I haven't gotten any stone from all this. Normally you get some. Okay. I want this to be full, or can I do this and have like like a window through? I already, I already know exactly what I'm going to do. Okay. So we're going to do this with the, uh, quote, stained glass block between the spaces, which will give us some light, but it'll also be a cool way to accent it. Alright, so let's do... I want to just do just like that. Do a three wide. You know what I think I would like to do? It would be nice to frame it. Let's go ahead and open it all the way up. Leave our column. Got to have a support column, of course. This thing I want to bring back, I think. Maybe, maybe back to this line here.
and this will be like the altar room I think assuming I can fit the the flame altar in here I don't know that I will be able to I can't remember how I did it the other when I I built it in the demo world back then and then this thing this could go way it's got gonna have multiple floors there's gonna be another level up there like his bedroom and I think what I did when I did this before is let's see if I can get a okay yeah that's fine I just need it so that I can get out to it can't get out to it because that thing's in my way let's I don't want to chunk it right now because I don't know what I'm gonna end up using it for um what I think I did before is made this to look like a pirate cave entrance, like a skull. Uh, it, Goonies, like Goonies. Yeah, I think if we do bars on this, that'll look really cool. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder how deep... The shroud goes pretty deep over here. I wonder if I can do like a a basement. Hmm. Makes me wonder. I'm not enshrouded here. I might be able to do an actual basement. So come down here and you go up underneath it to get like some even more dastardly, I don't know what, something. I don't like that I can see through there. It's probably because it's literally right to the edge. One of these days we'll get a better camera system. Yeah, still not shrouded. Sweet. That might is this might actually work to do a basement type space. Well, let's find out. Oh, I see my ceiling. Enshrouded. Okay. It's still my work. It's, it's still my work. We still might be able to do it. Dang it, I want to get just that. It's not going to make... not working for me. Alright, fine. Do it the hard way. Got a little bit of a hill. There we go. Alright. So it's only enshrouded over here, but not over here, and that's tall enough. That's easily tall enough to get into a uh, basement layer. That we have all this out there. Maybe I have another window out to the outside. Alright, let's see what we can do with this. Okay, so it's enshrouded this direction, so probably over this direction. Wow, 
I see no one shrouded. I wonder how far it's going to let us. How much further down as we get towards the other wall. I actually also wonder how much literally down we can go. No, what do we do? There we go. Awesome. Still not enshrouded down there. So yeah, we can make a pretty pretty swank basement. Oops. Matt. Fail. Alright. Well, failed that. Let's fix that. I still on the right thing. Castle block, yeah. Alright, so I need to be this layer here. What's up? Kali, or uh, Kaylee, Kali, Kaylee, something like that. What's up? We're in a different game today, doing some Enshrouded. I'm working on the uh, Halloween contest build. It's got to be something spooky. Got to be a haunted mansion, a graveyard, a something or other. So I'm making a necromancy tower. See what we can come up with. Ooh, I'm definitely close to Enshrouded because it had a red there. So I doubt I'm going to be able to get much deeper, but let's find out. Nope, that's so... Enshrouded's right below this level here. I think that's going to be okay, though. I think we'll be alright. I could bring it back another just to give a better feel for the head when you walk in. Like that. Is it just this one block? If it's one block, I can probably cheese it to get us one more layer deep. Okay, so I'm not enshrouded. I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be alright. Ah, damn it. Alright. So that gets us clear down to here. Yeah, it'll be deep enough for sure. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with stairs, though. Probably over this way. I don't think I can reach straight down, though. I might have to come... I don't know. I'll figure that out. Okay. Let's uh, pop over to... I don't know if you'll see me when I pop out. Oh, yeah, you can. Alright, let's go over the public resource world and let's get us some uh, other materials that we need. I need to get some more lights, too, so I can work. I'm not working in the dark. Alright. This is uh, the public resource world that I am currently the caretaker of. That's what I want. And that's what I want. Alright, what else? I don't want blue yet. I'm good there, but I do. I do. It's in the bottom. I do want some of that. Uh, did we have my sea lame in there? Uh, is that outside? I don't remember where I put my sea lame. It's probably outside. Let's also look at what do we got here for like cages and stuff. We'll get to that stuff later. All right, so if we've got this, so okay, public resource world is available to anyone who plays the game. You can load it onto your own 
computer. It's a, just a world file save. And it has, as you can see, everything. We literally have everything in the game. Every resource, every craftable, all the NPCs, everything's unlocked. Mainly for the reasons because, you know, we have jobs. We've got kids, school, uh, taking care of grandparents, all this kind of stuff. And we don't always have time to farm just constantly anymore. So some of us come together. There's three active public resource worlds. This one's uh, PRW V3.5. There's also um, Fort Resources uh, by Shade. And there's Wolfix uh, Public Mall or something like that uh, by Wolfix. And all three of us have everything. We have every piece of armor, uh, all the top end stuff, all the ammo, all the building blocks, you name it. And so we, we pool our resources together to come up with all this stuff so that it's easier for you guys when you just want to build. That's literally the purpose of it. I do want one of these in there, but man, I don't know how damn big that's going to be. I think that's going to be way too big. I think we might have to go with a smaller one and put a lid on it. Because even the big coffin's big. I will remember if this one, if it doesn't have a lid that fits it, I can't remember. We'll worry about that later. We need this kind of stuff. Okay, so not a crypt gate. Prison fence, prison corner. Let's go ahead and do some of this stuff. We'll need the corner piece. There's the door, which we don't actually have a door for yet, but... What else do we need? So I got that, I got those. It's probably good for now. I'm trying to think. This is the in here, this is the one I built. So um I am not the originator of this public resource world. Uh but I contributed to it by bringing all the books and stuff. Now, we had a public contest for that. That is uh, Emily's house. She's the farmer. Uh, there was a public contest for this one. This is the alchemist. And the armory was originally built by the creator of the public resource world. And it's got, you know, all the gear in it and stuff. And then I built when, um, or I should say after the uh, Hall of Halls came out, I built a Hall of Hall. And when I say that it's large, it's, I don't know if I'll ever get to finish it, because it's just so, so big. Look at that damn door. It's massive. Like, the collector, that's the guy I need. So if you come in here and open this up, I built all of this. This was all dirt. So I'm going to incorporate some some form of these mechanics into what I build. I I built and distressed this bridge. This was originally the end, but we had to move stuff. But yeah, it's a hell of a thing. I've even got a uh, pit of despair, like from Princess Bride. And it goes down, down. <laughs> so much so that there's no way to get up. You have to get on the map and teleport out. But yeah, it's fun. It's a lot of work. I don't know that I'll ever get it finished. It's just so much work. Built all this because we got gardening stuff with the update. Yeah, it's, it's fun. I just gotta see what else. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, lanterns and stuff. I need lights. Thank you. Alright. This is all shit that I just have laying around because I like to build stuff, so I have a lot of extra stuff. So I gotta. Th nope, I just saw it and I just passed it up. Well, there's one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. They definitely are gonna get that for a bed. I don't know, should I give them a lav or should I give them a bucket? We'll start with the lav.
do, do, do. Let's see. I'll take it over there and find out how big these big boys are. Let's take this one. I'll need a large coffin lid. I wish this lid would fix. I like the fit the lid better. All right. These things are too big for there. I do like the skull torches. Uh, there's some more lights. Okay. I love these. There's definitely going to have to be some of those in there. And some of these, of course. I will need this machine because I'm doing something fun with it. Alright. That should be good for now. Let's go back and uh, put some stuff in it. I don't think there's any way I'm going to get this done in one stream. But I plan to stream this for today, tomorrow. and We'll see how much it takes me. All right. Jumpy on down. Whoa. All right, so, not that, this. I need to see how these... Okay, all right. That, that definitely works. I definitely like that there, okay. Yeah, yep, yep, that's, I like that. Now I need to see how these all work and interact. So you gotta stack them. Alright, so we got it on. Okay. Which way's out? That way is. Okay. Oh, is it not gonna let me because of the shroud? I might have to uh, go grab the other thing that we used to use for it. I mean, let's do it this way. Ah, oh, it's still not letting me. You suck. Surface angle not suitable. Alright, let's try putting some more in there. See if I can get it enough. Alright, surely that's enough now. Unless it wants me to be above it. That might be the, it. I'm thinking that's what it is now. And if that if that's the case, I'm stupid. I'm going to laugh if this was the reason. That was the reason. I'm stupid. <laughs> I'm so dumb. Okay. All right. All right. So we got so we got it up. All right. <laughs> now that I... Yeah. I figured out how life works. All right. So do we want to do a door here? Or do I want to turn it like that? I think I should look to see... How's the bed going to fit in there? 
I mean, just because we're torturing them doesn't mean we, that we don't want them to get a good night's sleep. I mean, we want to have good, strong screams. All right. Now... All right, so we got a bed. Okay, cool. Now we need to see how... Let's turn off. Something's weird. It's not letting me rotate it. There it is. Try to make it look like it's just the bucket. No, back to it. We can't have them being comfortable. There you go. All you got's a pot to piss in. Now, let's see how we can do this door thing. So I could freehand it. There. Or we could put it here. That might give me enough room to put some torture looking devices in there or something. Maybe. I have never used these things, and I wonder if they're supposed to be... Yeah, because it doesn't match up. So what the hell are they supposed to be for? Yeah, now can I even pick it up? Alright. Well, uh, let's see if we can make a decision on this. Yeah, see, it won't snap in place either. I have to just eyeballs it. All right. Kind of that makes more sense to me than that does. Although a smaller... Oh, and we could have a wall locker with their stuff there. All right, let's do smaller. Okay, I can dig that. Let's do... I'm going to have to do it this way because it's going to shove it outside if I don't. It might shove it outside even if I do. That's got to go outside and look to make sure it's not clear outside the rocks. I think we're all right. No, oh, get back up there, turkey. Oh, will it snap to it now that I have? In the wrong spot. Dang. Okay. Bummer. We're going to have to cheese it again. Can't build there because there's a bed there. You suck. That gets us high enough. Unfortunately, I gotta eyeball this one too. So, I don't know if you played in Shrouded, but there's a problem with the doors. If the doors are there, nothing else, it doesn't want to let anything else near it. It's really weird. So now I gotta pick up my door, get my door out of my way. Put this thing back. You jerk. Let's 
kind of funny having to... I mean, that's probably any building game, if I'm being honest. Having to cheese things to get them to work. Alright. Come on, you jerk. Since I didn't snap it, it's not going to want to snap in spot. Yeah, this is going to be easy. Right. So I need something that height over there. Not that far over. What we do to cheese things, right? Come on, come on. <laughs> hey man, that's good enough for me. <laughs> uh, it's funny. No. Now picking up just the right things, that's going to be fun. No, get off of that. I saw it. There it is. <laughs> get off of the bed. <laughs> eh. There we go. Yeah, that works. Unfortunately, we don't have a door for these yet, so kind of just have to leave it without a door. I don't know why they put all that stuff in there that didn't bother to put a door, but it's whatever. So now I can put like a cabinet over here that would have uh, have their things, like their personal effects. Since this will be the altar room anyway. We're going to have some of this stuff going on. Uh, for now, let's just do it like this, just to get some light in here. Just get it nice and creepy. Now, let's see, I think I'm good with the entrance, here let's just put it there, there we go. All right, let's see how far it'll let us go here. So we've got... Weird, I can see outside a little bit. I mean, we're still in the right space because I still got Castle Wall. There's Rock. Still, though, it's, it's plenty of space for a nice basement. 
Maybe this is where we'll put, uh... We'll put his bedroom or something. Alright, so if we're going to do this, let's go that way. Okay, we can go that way quite a ways. probably a little bit weird watching me at this close quarters on Twitch, but I've kind of gotten used to it. I've been building a shrouder for so long that it's kind of used to the tight quarters. But I can imagine it looks a little weird. Okay. I think it's fine to have that big of a column there. Did I bring... I did. So this is one going to be one of the, quote, torture devices. Um, but I need something else to make it work. Oh, I, I brought that thing with me. Okay, hang on a second. So where's this going to be then? Maybe this room is for this then. Well, I don't want it in my bag yet then. If, that, if I'm going to make that room for it. Let's check out the tombs that I brought with me and see if anything's going to fit. Good lord! Man, that's... I don't know if I want to take up that much space. We. And that's just insanity. Though doing two of them kind of be cool. Side by side, maybe. And then this bad boy. Oh, that's way better. Okay, so before I put that, stick that over there. So we know the height. Let's do... Can I get any further down right here? We're going to do a little trick to light it up. that plus one really need to go back this far then right so I can't go down any further all right so that gives me the furthest I can go down and we take some of these drop them down inside of it come on Then, in theory, we take this, okay, grab our lid. Well, we want this, let's see. Which way would this open if it was... Well, it definitely couldn't open backwards because you got a wall there. Suppose we could just do it like that. It's not clipping into the wall or anything, nope. I need to move this. Huh. 
Yeah. So it looks like there's some evil nasty inside of there. Oh, I forgot to step on that. I fail. There we go. <clears throat> now I can get this where I wanted it to be in the first place, but I was having problems because I messed up and forgot a step. There we go. Of course it makes the lid harder now because it's further against the wall, but that's okay. Sure. And you can't see the lights. Yeah, that works. Gotta have some skulls around. It is Halloween after all. Still need to figure out how I'm going to do these. Do I want to do stairs here? Can I do stairs straight down? Will that work? Let's find out. Maybe, maybe. Crap. It's going to be a problem. nice. So not only can I make it work, I actually can go back further the other way. Or I can have that as a landing to do, I don't know what, something. I wouldn't mind having more space in here though, so that's okay. It could be an undercroft for something. Definitely better on space. Not much of an undercroft, but it could be something. I, I probably could find some stuff I could put down here storage wise that makes sense. There we go. That works. I don't think I want to deal with that. I think maybe we'll add some growths and stuff over here. I need to get some mycelium out too. What am I doing? Alright, let's see what we can do. Nice. 
like that. Not behaving like I want. Man, this is really not behaving like I want. I'll pair that up with some ice seal and make it look better. Man, those things put off a lot of smoke. It's cool. Alright, so we got a nice little spot there. We can come down here. I'll have to put a railing in there. I gotta go get fences for the railing. Oh, let's do that too. It's a lot easier to build with these lights than it is the green. about 12. Four, six, eight, ten. Should be able to go one set of two more, and then I'm probably going to be about as far as I can get. Yep, there's... Okay, so there's the post... Four. That's going to be this post right there. All right. I'm going to back it back one. Let's back it back one. Just so that we have a clear understanding of where we're at. Oh, it's not going to let me because of this shroud. Can't reach that one. That's fine. I 
I now have my dimensions there. Go up, take a look one more time. Make sure I'm not digging out too far. So if I've covered that. Ooh, it puts it real close to that, but I would be down some. I think I think I'll be okay. I just go straight this direction. I think it'll be all right. I bet I can get that spot now. Got it. Nice. Alright, so we got that covered. Now, the question we have is how far much further this way can we go? Further than that... Alright, so we've got a smooth plane there. Let's go check outside and make sure we didn't bust through. We did not. So this way, it looks like I can go 12 or so, maybe 14. And I'm about 8 or 10. 2, 4, 6, 8. I'm like, I'm about 10. Turning out to be quite nice indeed. Quite large. Alright, so we've got that is that wall there, which is right here. That's pretty much a sheer cliff out there, so that gives us four, six. It gives us like eight more blocks, tens pushing it. Well, let's just find out right now. So at least that far. Well, 
It'll be a pretty big damn basement. Hmm, makes me think. Should this be the, um... Oh, okay, so they said... Here, let me... I'm gonna pull up the... I don't think I can pull it up for you. I've got the page up, the rules. Alright. Must fill, fit with the contest Halloween theme, for example. Spooky mansion, underground dungeon, haunted graveyard, etc. So what I could do... To kind of mix and match with their their theme is this down here, as large as it is, this could be a tomb for multiple different, now that we have all these things, you know, the all these coffins and mausoleums and stuff, this could be that, and maybe maybe this dude is so depraved, he comes down here and robs the the corpses that are and the skeletons and stuff in there to do his experiments on. So I might end up moving that down there. That that could be what that is. This is the torture room. He's got a little jail cell to hold somebody in it. This is his secret entrance. Maybe this being the shrine altar room. And then right above this, because there's like 10 or 12 blocks above this to get to the top. That'll be like his study slash bedroom. And that's where I can put all the books and stuff. And then there'll be a way to get to the very top. Up here. I wish we had a trap door. That'd be awesome. We do have the secret door, but it isn't this castle material. So it's not going to really work that well. Let's see now that it's come up on daylight how this... Can you even see it? It's right there. I mean, if I jump over to it, you can see it, but otherwise you can't see that at all. That is brilliant. That worked out great. Love it. I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to take pictures of this thing, because it's all going to be like me jamming my camera up like this, and it's going to be interesting. <laughs> Try to get pictures of this damn thing for the contest. We'll see what I can come up with. I wonder if I should do that castle or if I should do it this material, the weathered. Like as you move into the depths, it goes into the weathered look. I think that's the right choice down here. I'll change it all out with the weathered. I think that I think that's going to look better.
Let's see. We've got one there. I don't know how much further I'm going to go there yet, so let's, uh, let's do it there. Because I might still get further into that stone. I think we're almost at our end. There's not almost about it. We are at the end there. I can't even go a block further there. Can I go half block? No. Alright, so we're at our limit. I wonder if that means I can't really get any... No, I cannot. So I so I was dead on on how far we could get with it. That's crazy. I was off by a little bit right here. But I could make that a feature. That's like a column. I could uh, do this number with it. It's not what I wanted. Castle wall. There we go. So now we got our support there, and now I need to replace this floor, which is a huge pain in the ass. Just do it this way, be easier. I'm curious how, how much deeper I can get in certain spots, which might even allow me to do another, not really a sub-basement, but another step down at least to again it's it's all about giving it I'm I uh, created a video a while back about how to make better towns and it's all about interest so trying to create those little those little nooks those little uh, offsets cantilevering a building uh, on the top over the building on the bottom stuff like that and in doing so you make the build interesting and therefore more people are going to like the way it looks versus less come on we can get it there we go versus it being fairly straight fairly bland and I'm wondering if I can do the same thing here weathered very nice Sweet, sweet. I need to be over one more. Uh-oh. Uh, let me do it, so I'll take it. Yep, and after doing that, I'm going to nuke it and see if I can go down any further. Because if I remember right, the shroud on that end over there is all much lower. Oh, I just thought of something. Depending on how low I can get this, 
I could have some kind of a built-in altar-like thing, and then have your your uh, uh, tombs and graves over here, and over here is kind of like a an altar of I don't know. I don't know exactly what I would come up with, but something interesting for sure. All right, I'm not enshrouded anywhere over here. So let's see how far that lets us go then. That's gonna be enshrouded. It won't even let me get it, okay. Doesn't tell me enshrouded. I mean, I can only go so far because I, I have to come down with stairs. So there's only so much I can even do anyway. Let's go. Uh, we're on weathered. That's what I want. Go six, and let's do it too wide. Doesn't leave me a lot of space to build, does it? Curious about something. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm literally to the one. Oh. If we had, okay, I gotta go out and see what what that looks, what, where that is, and what it looks like. Wonder if I can land in that tree. <laughs> Probably not. Okay, I see where it is. Ooh wee! I am pretty close to the bottom of the damn building. But I can over here go quite a bit further down. I uh, I'll get up there. Wait a minute. That wasn't me, was it? Is that my hole? I can't see because my body's in the way. Alright, no, there's my hole right there. Oh, I wonder if I could do... I don't know how I could do with that up there, though. I don't think I could make the skull the face of the skull work from here. I don't think it's going to fit well with the space. But it's good to know I can get down a fair bit more before I hit shroud.
question is, going down any more, what good is, does that do me? Unless I go down this way and that wall is this shrine thingy that I dig into the stone even. Hmm. Maybe. Three or four? One, two, it's four. Okay. Well. Nope. Someone won't. Alright, so now we come down this way, that'll give us the ability to put some kind of an interesting railing right there. He needs build area. I just built right there. How can I not build right here? Pain in my butt. Start with that. I might do little couple little pockets there of like bones and stuff as I see able. So now we could do a couple. I said, uh, what are you doing? I don't think any of those are going to be the right size. Should I do two this way, two that way? I'm thinking maybe I should. Except I want to mix them up a little bit. I don't want all the same. Definitely some of these would be fully sealed. probably going to be way too bright with those things, but we will try it and see. Aha! I need to finish out the roof, I need to finish out that wall, change all the floor over. We'll get a railing to put in up on this level. In fact, let's go check a look uh, what kind of railings we want to use. Oh, 
hell over here? I don't remember. No, they're up here. Copper or iron? I think iron's a little more fitting with what we're doing. Got an idea for that. Definitely have an idea for that. Bucket. Hmm, got an idea for that. put one of these some of these in the wall. Could be extra pieces instead of just all these guys. Simple coffin, coffin. I'm running out of space. Simple lid, coffin lid. Okay. These are all too big, unfortunately. All right, let's go back. Wall first. Weathered. Uh, no, that needs to be castle. Turn snapping off. Ooh, I'm nervous about doing that. Did I jack up anything outside? I did not. Perfect. Oh, I did. Well, I'm putting walls there anyway, so there you go. That's red. I know. One. Nope, oh, get it. Right height. Damn it. See how much it's missing. I can go that far, but I can't go that far. Okay. I don't know how much of that I can do by hand.
Boy, it's really twitchy about that spot. I mean, the other option is I make that a column. Boy, it really doesn't like that spot. I mean, it's a thing. Yeah, but then it's going to be in the way. All the king's men for a better camera in this build in this game that we build in. It's a little janky up there in that corner, and you know what? We'll just leave that corner. It kind of looks natural that way. All right, see how much of this wall we can finish. Very good. We got a little bit messed up. All right, now let's get rid of this stuff. Change the floor. Whoa, what's down there to pick up? Is that the light up there? That's funny. There is no enshrouded down here. But that's four, and I like I like things to be the same, so we're going to keep this. I mean, I could just keep it just one level down. Alright, so we need to change this to floor. Start there. No, no, big, smaller one. There you go. Weathered. Alright, there we go. There's Entrouded. Alright, so we got some bones, we got some stuff around. Oh man. Really? How'd I mess that up? That's only three right here, and that annoys me. Well, that's just going to have to be what it's going to have to be.
Less the less the bottom step. That even that annoys me. <laughs> oh man. I really should not build in games. I'm too much of a perfectionist to <laughs> build stuff. I end up changing things a million times. Alright. We got this guy. Well, it has a little bitty sucker in it. Oh, it's enshrouded right there. You suck. Well, the other way I can do it. Yep, that's the way we're going to do it. We need to come out one more course. I right, got some bones and stuff. And now, this should go up here just fine. I should be able to fit two of them just fine. Even go back a little bit so we can have offerings in front of them. Yep. Me like. So let's say that jerk got into that one. Okay. And then we'll put a bunch of like offering items up against that. We can even Fancy it up a little bit. Kind of table like. All right, so how many is in between? Six, seven, eight, nine. There's the center. All right. That's looking nice. So then we would come down here, and this will be some kind of an altar of something. So, something they pray to, or... I don't know. i got to figure that out. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. Will this fit? Ish. I don't love it. What about going further? Have just the. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. And I only have one, so I gotta grab the other one from upstairs. Alright. So we need more space and more depth. Alright, so what we're got the idea here is Where to go? There it is. We're gonna go in end to end. We 
going to have two of them. Like may maybe these slide out or something. Something. I don't know. Uh, build. Okay, so that takes up that, that. So I need right here. Kind of like that. Next one, here it is. Yeah, I like it. I like that a lot. Uh, except I haven't done my railings yet. Alright, let's see what I can do. might seem weird what I'm doing but I gotta make space to sink the railing down into the layer below it and then I can just bring those right back Dang it. Okay, let's put this away. There we go. Okay, so do I want them, how do I want these to match? I'm like this, or do I want to go all the way? If I go all the way, I need one more piece. Well, I suppose I don't have to go all the way. Then this last one will have to overlap. Overlap right to there. Okay. Put this back on. And right back in. And there you go. That's how you use sunken railings. Yeah, I don't love the patterns a little off, but you know, it's, you know we'll, we'll, we'll make it happen. All right, so we got that. We got our little tombs up here. We got those there. I know what I want to do with these walls. I, I've got some ideas for that. Do I have enough space? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we got all this stuff, too. which will be really difficult because it's enshrouded down here. I gotta find somewhere I can even stack it because of the enshrouded. You know what, I wonder if I put a floor there, if that'll help. Let's try that because <laughs> it's being a jerk. Uh, hammer, where'd you go? There you go. Back to castle. Even it's going to be like, nah, I can't go, fam. You dug too greedily. Bro, I can't even get it if I do that. Jeez.
Okay. I, mean, I can still get up here, so that's good enough. <laughs> One single piece, you jerk. Can I get it? Can I get it? <laughs> Alright, well, I guess that's where the... Uh, <laughs> that's where the growth is coming from. Kinda. Why won't you spawn? I cannot get it to flower, and I don't know why. Oh, there's a little bit. Got a little bit. And killed it. Alright, just leave it there then, I guess. Now, let's see if I can get anything to stack in here. I can. Did I bring any barrels? I did. Let's try a big-ass barrel first. Kind of like, like the barrels kind of... I got myself stuck. Do I want to do two? Helps take up the space really well. Do do do. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, yeah, this. Uh, the idea for this is right here. Because this is all broken fence, because we got a broken wall. Genius. Alright. Got some boxes. You know, he'll have like embalming fluid and all kinds of stuff that he's doing to these poor poor denizens. That looks good. Just a little, a little touch of, uh, you know, what else is he going to use the space for, right? So you got this little space down here, just kind of, yeah. I'll put another railing here. Question is, do I want to go up, or should I just do a stone railing up here? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. Let's get us some light, shall we? I can see if I want to rim it or if I'm fine with this size. All right. It seems awful big. really have anything good to... I guess we'll just go to... Ca no, not weathered. Castlestone. Give it depth. Looks good. I like it. Won't be very easy to give it depth in the back, though. I give it a shelf.
And that's what I can attach to the yaw yaw. We got this. This is going to be temporary. I'll replace it in a minute. I just need something here to remove some of this. Alright. Railing. Start this way. There we go. Let's go like that. Like that. Perfect. That's pretty low. That's really low. What the shit? Why is it so much lower than this one is? I did it the exact same way. That's weird. Uh, that's really weird. So what's it like without... Alright, we'll do it without it then. Because that's. I wonder if I can just pick it up. Okay. That's okay, then that matches that height pretty well. I like it. I like it a lot. Maybe over here will be a chair and a little little table or something for him to work on. Because the machine is going to go here. This is how he does really bad things to people. And I need more pieces. I also got to remember how exactly I did it. I made this really cool sculpture structure with it. Actually, I can show you. And we'll go ahead and grab the piece while we're over there. Public resources. There's a secret, not secret anymore, room that I built in the hollow hall over there that has what I'm going to build for this. I need to go get a head. Alright. We're going to do... Yep, yeah, we're going to do this one. Why isn't it letting me split it? Alright, fine. We'll just take ten of them then. Whatever. Alright, let's go take a look at it real quick. Get some idea what I'm going to build. So down here in the, I don't know why it's open, it shouldn't be open, in the secret room is that. I merged the two of them together and there's even lights up in the thing, there's lights beneath it. It's, it's a mess. It's To get it all right is, is tricky. But it's awesome. And I'm going to replicate this in there, and I'm going to replicate these chains if I can figure out how to do them over there. It takes a lot of chunking out below and going down to get the chains in there right, but we'll see what I can come up with. I'm going to add that thing in there. I already grabbed one of those. So essentially, <laughs> the whole build is just to replicate this room, basically. You know, a little, little wall fireplace... Because the, cha the chains are totally unique to me. I was the first one to do them. I was not the first one to do this on the wall. But these putting these chains, the chains are actually massive braziers. Do I have any? 
Oh shit, I don't have any hanging in here. Okay. Well, I'll go up and show you which ones they are. They're absolutely gigantic. Uh, do I have them? As extras somewhere. Oh, uh, we gotta definitely put a kettle down as a cauldron. This. It is insane how big it is. So this whole entire apparatus is buried under the ground just so that I can have the chain sticking up. It's insane and I love it. And I don't know how I'm going to be able to do it in this in this spot, but if I can it's it's fantastic. All right, let's go back. What am I hearing when I'm spawning in? Oh, I know what I'm hearing. That chest open and close. Which is weird, but whatever. Okay, so I'm not beneath this, except for right here. I wonder... So I will be able to do it. <laughs> when I don't go below the level. Yeah, that's going to be interesting. Question is, is it sticking outside somewhere? Uh, kinda. Yep, it's sticking outside. No, I'll have to I'll have to fix that. <laughs> uh, it's funny. So it definitely can't be right there. The l earliest it can be is like right here at this corner, right where my ass is pointing up. But that'll work. So that that's good too. That I know I can do that now. And this guy goes on the wall behind that. I'm just going to stick him up there so I remember. And his eyeball follows you, which is awesome and creepy at the same time. But I love it. Right, I went back for something and I didn't grab it. I went back for toilets. I know it sounds weird, but I'll show you. This, before we got the update uh, back to the shroud that gave us, like, cemetery stuff and all that... We didn't have a way to do, like, tombstones. So we did it with toilets. And that's what I'm going to do. Tombstones with toilets. <laughs> So once upon a time, you know, we had to uh, do a little something like this. I don't remember if we had to do two P. Let's just do it this way. So let's do... Ah, oh, bummer, it's not centered. That's a bummer. Well, uh, let's put that in and then I'll fix that real quick. We did this. Right, we only need one piece. That's going to be hard for me to see what the hell I'm doing. 
No, I don't want to sit. I want to pick up. No, pick up. Thank you. There we go. Alright, so we get it to where it's just coming out. Like that. Boom. Tombstone. Yeah, reasonably enough. Alright. Let's do this. There we go. Maybe we'll just do one here. It'll be a different level. So now we have quite a bit for uh, this small place. And then we got these guys down here, which is fucking brilliant. I love it. I'd love to do some more in here, but I'm already at my limit. Seems like they would pack a lot more people in here, though. I wonder if we do that and that instead of where it is. Seems to me, you know, real estate is pricey, so they're going to pack people in like sardines. Especially if you don't have a bunch of money. They're really going to jam you into spaces. I like that better. Yeah, well, we'll, do, we'll deal with that, okay? So, we're going to have a whole bunch of, like, swag and stuff in here. Do I have any pluck? I don't. Nope. I still got to figure out what the hell am I doing in this. I feel like there should be a relief. Not that. Let's do... There definitely would probably be one of these sitting like like right here. Seems a pretty logical spot. Maybe uh maybe we do a little bit of these this time. We could do some kind of a banner or something there. Yep, that one's off. That sucks. There we go. I was thinking about doing this, though. Alright, let's make this spiky boy. Can we do the spiky boy? Sort of. Oh, I got X on. No! Oh, that doesn't do that. Okay. 
We could, just to make it, like, that much nastier. <laughs> yeah, spikes against one whole wall. That's so mean. I think we're going to have to, uh... <sighs> I don't think I can. Well, I guess he's going to have to try not to stab himself when he's doing the dookie. Because it doesn't want to move. <laughs> Whoops. That could be an interesting place. Not build here. It curious to know why. That's so random. I wonder because here a little bit of it sits outside. No, because it's not the way it is in, in the hollow hall. I don't know. We'll figure it out later. Why are you peeping me, bro? All right, let's go do our relief of something. I suppose it could be a double something. So, have a relief that comes up. You got a centerpiece of relief that comes up and it could be two somethings. We do have We do have those statues for the um Vuka. Okay, so I feel like we're going to raise up. Okay, so I got an idea here to, to backlight it coming downward. Let's go three wide. Skip one. Three wide. Essentially like galleries. So then I, what I would do... So I have a, a section up here where I got one deeper. We're going to go even more. No. Nope. So I'm too higher, which means I can hide the the lit stones. Right. So I'm coming up right to that right. So there's, um, well, I mean, it's like, oh, I have some on me. Nope, that's highly polished. I mean, it's like the ectoplasm block, but it's white, and I can hide those up in there as a down light. Leave it stone backing. I kind of like that idea, but then again, I could also... Go back a little further. And I could back it. I think I want to back it with the red from the um, oh, 
Hollow Halls update. What did we do? What did I just do? Damn it. I like where it is, though. I'll figure that out later. Now we have any more light. Can't see. Camera sucks. I think that's the same level. So now it gives me plenty of space in there to light that. You know, honestly, what I could do is this. Just do a lot more of this shit. Big cancerous growth. Nice if it popped more of the flowers. Mm. Kind of okay with that. What about let's do a little bit more? That's interesting. Okay. And a little bit more over there. Cool. Get some mycelium down there. Can I get another flower to pop off? Eh, of course I messed with it too much and I lost it. And I got it back. Alright, that'll work. So that covers that, and now we have our two, whatever we're calling this thing, shrine somethings. And it's enshrouded, so I'm going to have to go up more. I don't have a choice. Hmm. Weathered. It's all fucking enshrouded. Damn it. <laughs> oh, the problems of doing stuff like this. Oh man, this could be an issue. Well, that's just going to have to be good enough. So weird how the way the system works, too. How you can come off of a certain part and it's fine, and then you can't come off of another part and it's not fine, but then it's kind of fine, but then it's not. I think that'll be good enough to actually... Ooh. What about that? I 
I wonder if I should even frame it with the weathered. Or just not, because that looks cool. Alright, let's see what rimming it with a weathered looks like. I think that's the right call. Yep, I think that's going to make this pop better. It's actually kind of fitting that that thing's popping in through the back side. Hmm. It's going to be a problem. Okay, well, screw you then. That definitely brings more attention to it by doing it that way. 100%. I could maybe, maybe even do a little bit of shenanigans down here. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> it worked. That's awesome. Alright. That's cool. That worked out just fine. Yep. Alright, so... We've got the makings of something cool. I need to back that with the other color. We got this... I don't like how they're offset a little bit, but that's okay. We'll have to deal with it for now. Let's see... Right. I'm not done with the roof. Be very careful not to go even a single block too far, otherwise it puts it way out into nowhere land. There we go. Alright, we got the ceiling done, we got the floor done, we've got some carved out nooks. Man, if this had one more block between them, I could carve a nook in there for uh, placing items. Well, what if I did...
I feel like at some point you're just embellishing too much and it's like calm down calm your tits bro okay so we got that we can't go that direction just because of I could however could do a little nook up here Can I put do the same thing here? Let's say they had a little bit more money. Well, I guess do the same on both. Alright, so we're gonna have a little little space over there. We'll put little urns and shit up there. Got stuff for that. Screw this guy, he's just by himself. We'll put a little th plot of flowers in front of him or something. And then we gotta get those things there. This could use maybe a few more things to really flesh it out. I gotta get more mycelium, some mycelium for down there. I feel like I don't need to have this thing all the way over. There we go. So we'll come down that way. He's gonna have that uh that throne chair of bones and something and probably uh ta an altar table. We're gonna have a little cabinet over here, maybe one right there. There are hanging ones of these that I might put in. We'll have to see. What else could we do to really tweeze this up? I don't know. So I like where that is and I don't want to mess with that. But I feel like all the rest of this is game. Yep, I can't go much... I don't know if I can go any deeper because of the uh, the deals I built down there. Let's find out. I don't see him. So from there, boy, I'm already really flirting with it. And there it is. Here. No. Wow, it's even, it's here. That, that won't work. It's, it's that, that's as far as I can get. All right, so this needs to go back. Getting into the up part's gonna be tough. Going up here, I don't even remember how I did it with stairs, but figured something out. Alright, so if we're coming off right here...
shut all the rest of this. That's interesting, the stone was already over the structure. Hmm, that's interesting indeed. So I feel like I could come back here, put in a corner, corner section of bookcases, the little... something, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I could do that. Little corner section of bookcases. Alright, there's already some damage right there. That means that is probably the last one piece to the outside. I'll leave this little section there for now. Leave my beams. There we go. Alright, so that gives me some depth for something. I can't move anything or touch anything here, otherwise the uh, <coughs> chest spawns, And then it won't let me let me ever use it again, which sucks. So i got to kind of leave it. That's alright. How much depth do I have? I have quite a bit of depth here. Let's, uh... Yep, might work. I think that might work. So far, so good. I haven't broke through anything. Let's go back to this one just to make sure. Still letting me. It's amazing how much space there is in this that the devs, I don't know, built, didn't think about it, didn't think anybody's going to come in and do anything with it, and then, you know, along comes this idiot and was like, hey, let's, let's cut the whole space and see what we can build inside of it. <laughs> Alright, we gotta be pretty much there. We... I'm pretty sure that's... It's something weird, so let's, uh... Well, hang on.
Yep, we are outside. Okay. There we go. So, that's our line there. Castle wall. That is our no-go. Alright. Now we got our line in the sand. Still though, that gives us a decent amount of space to put something here. Um, let's see, let me look at that. We can go one more double block deep before we cause any problems, I think. That does look to be correct. Oh, oh, nope, we're okay. Yeah, we're all right. I can go one depth here, but I don't know that I care enough. Let's do this guy right there. There we go. And then this one, because we have the mycelium right on the other side, or the, um, the glow block right on the other side, that's as far as you're going. Daylight outside, yay! Alright, let's chip away just a little bit. Not too much. Just a little bit. Alright, so let's get the floor going. finish the ceiling. What do I have to remove up there? What did I place up there? I think this is a good spot to have a uh, hidden door, hidden castle door, because you already got this right here, so it's going to blend in beautifully. Okay, I'm trying to remember. Do you have to cinch it like that? Or is it one more lower? I think it's one more lower. Yeah, it's definitely smaller than that, that's for sure. Um, this way. 
Now in here, oh, that could be neat. We'll come in when we get the other block and rim that. And we'll have to find something interesting to place in here. Right, let's pop back over to Public Resource World and grab us a uh, secret door. Should be this one. Okay. I could try that up top, but I just I just don't think it's gonna look good. Alright, let's go back. I love the way that turned out. All right, secret door time. I think I need to come one down. Let's find out. Well, first off, I need to get it in there, right? kind of hard to make it a secret when you can still see it, you know what I mean? It is so obvious. Alright, let's try something here. down lower. I don't think I'm going to be able to get anything on the inside. Still so blatantly obvious. All right, we're going to get we're going to make this work. I don't think I'm going to get it any better. Make sure you can get into it. Okay, so we can get in. Maybe I'll make this the bathroom. All right, so we got a little secret in our uh haunted whatever thing necromancy lair. Alright, so we got this decently fleshed out. We'll need some more stuff for it, but we're getting there. Got those. Storage needs a few more things. Prison cells mostly done. Maybe I'll get some propaganda pieces up or something. Let's see, what else? Let's see if I can go this way any any amount. Something.
Okay, so there's the outside, but it is here, so I can go ahead and come on. Thank you. Kind of do that jobby and finish it all back out. Noise. All right, so we know that's the wall at least. But it does mean we can get more out of this too. Probably. Excuse me. Little bulbous node in my way. Alright, how much further? Hmm, okay. I'll take every bit I can get. Okay, so I get one, one more right there. I think what we'll do, no, we'll take our one and be happy with it, and we'll just call it at that. Oh, come on, there it is. Like, we'll just have, have to be happy with our one, and I think that's where we're going to put our wall. like that. Put one more. There we go. Noise. Very nice. All right, so we've got a pretty decent sized room in here. I think we'll go ahead and bring this down. Maybe. Yeah, because it would, it would go back to this part here, not over here. Right. And it will go to here. Yep. Yep, that'll give us more space in here. Oh, what am I doing? 
no I wanted to ring it that way so that means it's going to come across dummy alright let's leave that there it's this stuff up here I need to get rid of Should work. Get me a flow. Check outside just to make sure we don't want it sticking out of the stones. Woo, it's bright. Alright, I don't see anything sticking out over there. Yes, yeah, so the idea from this end, and I'm going to have to real carefully edge out the stone, is like the Goonies, the skull, um, that was in the rock inside the cave, the bathroom that they went to. There's the mouth. Put an eye up there and an eye up there because upstairs is going to be his, I don't know, bedroom, whatever you want to call it. It'll probably be his bedroom. He's got he's got to be able to watch the uh, denizens from from where he's where he's at. So. Wonder how I want to how do I want to do the staircase? Probably spiral like I usually do, but I don't know yet. Well, I suppose I don't have to have these stairs clear out here. I have to have them a fair distance, though, because of this. Nope, I brought it all down, so... And I brought it down to that level. I start before, start after. I think that's going to look just fine. Yep. <coughs> Pardon me. Yep, I like it. Let me grab a drink. Oh man, we just hit three hours. I think that's good for today. We got a lot done. We got this gutted, mostly. This is all gutted. That's all gutted. Then we'll have the upstairs to do, which is right above here and below the upper deck. Right. <coughs> Excuse me. Below all this. And then we'll move this guy somewhere. I'm not really sure where I'm going to put it yet. If I'm going to make it a feature up here or if I'm going to put it inside. Not really sure. I'd love to have everything inside so it's all hidden. Hmm. Don't know. I appreciate you watching. Thanks everybody stopping by. We'll see you the next time.